Well, good morning. Hey, you know what? I said questions and answers, and I want to thank everybody. Great, great questions. Um, I hope to have some great answers. <laughs> okay, so let's start. Let's get started. Uh, where we're starting is we got the first questions. Are you allowed to tell how many things? And this is from SCP Velvet. If you're allowed to tell how many things are there so far, well, you can see right there, 230. So that, that's how many I'm allowed to say or tell is that's the number. You'll, you, I can't hide it. So, so I match up whatever uh, Polyhex is showing in their stuff and then go from there. Yeah. And so if they show something and they show a number that I match it. So anyways, so that's, so yes, I'm allowed to tell, but I, I match what Polyhex, uh, what they show. Okay. Now, uh, the next question is, is going to be, and let's, let's look around and, uh, you can see this is just absolutely gorgeous around here. You can actually move a little bit better and stuff like that. And I know I'm still the old, I'm not doing the A, the, you know, A, S, D, A, E, F <laughs> type of thing. Hey, this is from Sally. Sally God Lover 687 Alt. Um, how do you make your videos? Okay, how do I make my videos is I make them through OBS. Um, I, I my OBS, uh, I use a mic, an Audio Technica. Um, I use two screens. I have um, a teleprompter, uh, GH3, uh, Lumix, Panasonic camera, and I have a whole bunch of lights and things like that. So uh, I most of the time, you've seen me live sometimes, most of the time I always just go through my character, this, and then that's, uh, that's what I do on that. So that's how I make it through OBS. And then I use CapCut to, to move it up to 4K and go from there. So it takes a little bit longer than it usually used. I used to go right out just to do high definition, but I went up to 4K now, if you want to go there. Okay, and then um, let's go in with the other, the, the other question, and I hope I'm not boring the heck out of everybody, like, well, move around. Okay, the next one is uh, by me, Fan Cat. Is there going to be any real enemies in the main map? Um, I I don't know. I don't know. I really didn't understand the question. Um, there might be. I don't know. I have absolutely no idea. I've not been told. I don't think the game is set up as an enemies, if that makes sense. Um, okay. What will happen with the... And the next one is by Stop Mo Player. Great person. What will happen with the ant thing in the Toxic Tree River since they added a new ant thing at Spawn Hill? Well, let's look. Now, I might, I've been doing this for a little while. Hopefully, I can get in there. And let's go ahead and we're going to warp. Let's go ahead and we're going to warp over to uh, Ballyhoo Bluffs. And, and then you can see there's a new, they really made more textures on them. The stuff that they're doing is just unreal. So, and, and again, I looked at the uh, stuff that you're playing in and it's so light. You can look back over here and it's super, super light and, and they've darkened everything and it, it's, oops. And then they, you can, oh, come on, there we go. Um, and then anyways, we go over there and this gets really gets, and this really gets really, look how the color, the coloration is just unbelievable. Now let's go in here. Let's, I don't want to get hit. <laughs> Okay, here's Toxic Tree River, and hopefully I'll make without making any mistakes. Okay, okay, there we go. And let's, uh, let me see, there we go. And I think we can go over there. Oh, <laughs> come on, let's go. I, You can get up there, Dad gum. Why is it doing that? Oops, ah. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Come on. I never had this problem before. Let's go again. Let's go again. I have never had that problem right there. I was able to go up there with no problem at all. Anyways, let's go in. If I have to, I can reshoot this. Okay, let's go into Toxic River. I'm trying to show you the ant. So anyways, let's go in. And uh, we'll go in. And let's go over here. 
I can think we can do this. I don't know why this is doing that. Okay. There we go. Dad, rum it. Okay. Here's the ant. Now you can look at the ant. And you can see that the ant that is on um, Spawn Hill is a lot different. It's almost like a hobo. I I don't think they'll take that away. I just I just don't think they will. You know. All right. Let's go ahead and let's uh, let's go ahead and, and uh, go back to Thingsburgs right now. And uh, anyway, I just want to kind of show you on that. Let's just go from there. Um, anyways, the next question is. Um, what will happen with the ant thing? Okay, Sam Draw uh, Jurors 537. Is the update close to finishing? Now, let's go ahead and look at that, okay? Um, is that close? Now, Polyhex said a whole lot of things about that, okay? So, we're going to go over and we're going to hear or we're going to show what Polyhex said to her, has had to say. Uh, here it is. Find everything player. Sorry for the slow news for so far this year. We've been working all, but all of us have been dealing with things that get in the way of development. The game will be changing in a lot of ways, which means we can't push it out before it's fully done. Now here's the ant. You can see it's like a hobo. It's a much different than the one I just showed you. Okay, so we go in there. I wish we could just pump out levels and call it a day but find everything's got systems that need to get done such as inventory save files shops we've also started reworking the game's world to be larger and work better on slower devices less cramped overworld and i've shown that in other videos where everything's been split up and just moved around a lot and that's kind of happened you can see that they've shown uh, something kind of nice and uh, let's go back in here. While being personally happy with the state of the game right now, it's clearly not done. There's a lot of quality of life features to add, worlds to flush out, character sees, ugh, and monetization to think about. And um, Noma has talked to me about that. I don't think about the game every day. And what there is left to do, there is a lot. Okay, every update we release, we'll have to, it's almost like a launch all over again. And we aren't even out of early access yet. A big thing in this update will tackle us is getting us closer to free release. Making a game like this on Roblox isn't exactly common or easy to do. We appreciate your patience. In the meantime, you can join the FB Find Everything Discord or follow, I'll follow on Find Everything to learn about updates from reviews as they happen. We love this game dearly and want to make big things that happen. Thanks for reading. Anyway, so that's kind of what's going back. Let's go back over. And you can see that um, the developers really, I mean, all three of them are just like, they really, really care very, very much of what's going on here. So it's just one of those things that we just, it's just, you got to have patience because they blew up the game. As you can tell, there's, there, it is all by themselves. This used to be together. They're not anymore. <laughs> that makes a huge difference. All right. So that's the, for Sam D Drea Gears Neobites. What's your favorite part of Find Everything? I want to say everything, but I really like uh, what's it Woods. I've always liked that place. It, I, that's that's one area that I've really really liked. Program Squid. Why did you start this weekly video? That's a tough one, and that was fun. I, I and actually there's a reason. And let's go back into it. And let me just show you exactly why we did what we did there and why it started. And it, it's a great story. And let's, and again, we're going to start off and let's go over. We're going to find it again and we're going to go over to write. Okay, here it is. Mom, dad, gaming. It all started there. What happened is that my wife and I, uh, what happened is a, a number was doing, uh, what had just been hired at Adopt Me, and and they, you know, was kind of excited and was, hey, you know, you you guys should be making games of all the stuff, you know. I go, hey, I'd love to. Let's rock and roll. Let's do it. So we went ahead and started that, and my wife absolutely loved, adored, to this day, every uh, spends hours on Adopt Me, uh, adores it. Anyway, so what happened is that. It started, so we started this, and then what happened is Nomer came and said, hey, you know what? 
we're doing another game, Find Everything. And what's happening there is this is a game that Polyhex, Socks, and, and I, and what we're doing is that this is a place that we just, it's our refuge. It's our place where we're super busy. You know, like, like Polyhex has super bomb survival. And, and then, of course, Socks has a big twitch, is building games. And it, all of us are together. And this is where we can just kind of relax. Find everything is our relaxed place. And this is where we go for solace. I said, hey, hey, Dad, but would you like to go and, you know, go in there and, you know, look at it? You, you know, maybe that would be good for the, you, you know, for the mom, dad gaming that we can go ahead and you can start video. I go, hey, I'm glad to. So we went ahead and started it. So if you look at mom, dad gaming, you'll actually see the beginnings of it. And actually what happened was that in, uh, what was that? March? Was it May? May was when it was, no, excuse me, March 2, 2022 was when the first one came out. So let's go ahead and have a look at the progression. And what happened after that is, you know, no more was going, you know what? Why don't you, you know, you, uh, everybody saw it. Polyhex, Socks, they're like, your dad's really going crazy about this. I, I, and no more goes, yeah, he kind of. He loves it. So, well, why don't, why is it, why don't your dad, why don't, why don't we set him up? He'll be the dad of Find Everything and he'll be the YouTuber. And let's set up a separate game exactly for it. I, I went, I'm in, I'm all in, and I'm going to do it every week. I said, they, everybody says, hey, it sounds good to us. Okay, so anyway, so that's why it was becoming exploring, find everything. That, it, that's where it came from, okay? Now, the next thing was they said, okay, let's be a dad, and they put me in as dad. They also, Polyx was just super, oh, wow. You put me in, in special thanks because of, of this whole thing of that I'm doing the game here. And then after that, uh, they, as you can see, in the YouTuber, uh, Polyhacks put that together. I, no more calls me dad, so I'm just that the dad of find everything. And that's where I, this is all came in together on this. And of course, you know, Polyhex has some things was showing on there, and so it will be ready when it's ready. So just you know, that's what's going on. It is that's that's why that this is where I'm in in this scenario. Okay, so. Anyway, a lot of stuff there, but that, that's what happened on that. Okay, and then why did I, and then Sally says, why was there a mysterious person on Blue Who Beach on one of your videos? Okay, that was a boo-boo. <laughs> that, what happened is I'm told specifically to stay away from certain areas. Um, I'm supposed to stay away from Spawn Hill, um, Thingsburg, there's, there's two of them. Uh, it used to be Spawn Hill had two. Now there's one. So I have to stay away completely away from there. There's also parts in What's It Was that I might be going ahead of myself that are that are with, uh, that I have to stay away from. Um, anyways, so that's why was there. It was just I accidentally went in there and Polyhex goes, I wasn't supposed to show that. And so I apologize. Uh, usually I... I'm, I'm, you know, I usually know that. It's just one of those, it was an accident. Um, when did you first hear of Find Everything? That was from uh, Worthy. And what, and I basically answered that. That's when, uh, with, uh, uh, you, you know, Adopt Me, and it came in through that way. And then, um, what is your, Gulasi 10? I apologize if I messed up your name. Uh, what is your favorite number? It is seven. That's my number. I love seven. Okay, that's just that's just that's just me on that. Okay, um, and then um, the first video was in March of two of two thousand twenty-two, and then uh, um, Neobite uh, asked, "How much information do developers let you share about sneak peeks and such?" Uh, okay, well, let me go over it again. I'm told to stay away from uh, two parts in uh, in uh, What's It Woods. There's, uh, of course, Spawn Hill, stay away completely. Thingsburg, stay away. The, the, the other thing is, and I don't know how we're going to do it. We haven't come to it yet. But when they start connecting 
up. I'm supposed to stay away from the connections at those areas. So there are areas I'll, I'll have, there's lots of places on there. Um, and then, uh, so that's, so how much information do they let you share? The, they let me, they kind of like, don't do this, don't, don't show here. There's a lot of areas I'm told not to stay away from completely. And let me just make sure. And then uh, there was another question. Uh, do they, there are areas that, uh, one was the smelly, uh, smelly sewers. Is that going to be part of it? Uh, I don't know. The answer to this, I don't know. Right now it's really empty. They told me I can go, I go in there, but there's nothing to see. It, it's just, if you look at my videos, you'll see that, that there's just nothing. Everything's been taken out. Will that include the numbers in there? I don't know. That there's some things I'm just not told, and I really don't want to know. That that's something that I'm I'm happy not to know. <laughs> and then the last question you is, what inspires you to keep making movies, and do you come with your video ideas? Uh, how I do it is that every week I go in. Usually there's a whole lot of changes going on. So the first thing I do is that we have our own, the disc testers, there's 45 of us, we have our own Discord. So in there I go and I say, is it okay if I do this, this, and this, and show this, and what is my parameters? And then Polyhex will come back and say, okay, these are your parameters, this is what you can do. And so that will be what, what I'll follow through. And then at that point, then I just kind of go and say, okay, let's release. And then I just go through, follow it, and then go up, and then you guys in Discord talk, and then and also and just say hey and ask me questions there. Anyways, I I'm sure I lost a couple of questions, but if there is any more, ask me and I can bring them up for next week. I want to thank you so much. This has just been a blast. I love this game, and uh, I just have I'm just I'm inspired by what Polyhex, Nomer, and Socks are doing. Anyways, take care. And it's so good. And hopefully we'll see each other again. Take care.